Internal government discussions suggest that the demand for special category status by the BJP's key allies, TDP and JDU, for Andhra Pradesh and Bihar respectively, will be hard to meet. This is due to the socio-economic and fiscal needs of several other states. Now let's have a look at what this means. Earlier, special category states received 90% funding from the centre for centrally sponsored schemes, with only 10% from the state. Comparatively, other states had a 60-40 to 40 split. Normal central assistance was also more favourable for special category states with a 90 is to 10 grants to loan ratio, compared to 30 is to 70 for other states. The government fears that granting this status to Andhra Pradesh and Bihar could trigger similar demands from other states. Instead, support may come in the form of special packages like funds for building Amravati in Andhra Pradesh or more central projects. The Finance Commission, which replaced the Planning Commission, did away with the concept of special category status. However, special treatment continues for erstwhile special category states, with a 90 to 10 sharing in centrally sponsored schemes. States may be asked to present their requests for special category status to the 16th Finance Commission under Arvind Pangaria. The Commission will start touring states in late June to consult with chief ministers and key officials about their funding and tax devolution needs. There is no legal obstacle to reverting to the earlier system, but funds could instead be provided as special packages, which would be a political decision. For Andhra Pradesh, this includes financial assistance under the Andhra Pradesh Reorganisation Act for constructing the capital city of Amravati. Earlier funds for Amravati were not fully disbursed due to stalled construction. A CAG report in September 2023 raised concerns about incomplete infrastructure projects and financial burdens from the land pooling mechanism. The report highlighted that 57 infrastructure packages costing 33,476.23 crore awarded between July 2016 and February 2019 remained incomplete despite spending 4,901.67 crore rupees. Delays in submitting required clarification resulted in a lack of further financial support from the Government of India. For more updates, keep watching The Indian Express.